Rhodey approaches his empty war machine armor, takes off the Iron Man armor and orders it to fly home. Before he can switch to his suit, a sentinel knocks him down with a grazing blast and confiscates it. Iron Man breaks free from the sentinel hand, but when he looks for Rhodey, Tony finds him surrounded by Stark sentinels and Orca shock troops. Unable to intercede, Tony stoops down on the ground and begins to recite the serenity prayer. A few hours later, during the day, Phylon convenes with Dr. Stasis and Nimrod to assess the destruction of the facility. Phylon assures his allies that he has secret facilities producing sentinels, so although they won't have enough machines ready for the Hellfire Gala to eliminate all of their planned targets, they will carry out their plans incrementally.